In this tutorial, I'll show you how to apply this amazing color step by step in Photoshop. So first step, import your image and after that, from the layers panel, active background layer, then we need to make a duplicate, press and hold Ctrl Command J, then right click and convert it to smart object. Then press and hold Ctrl Command Shift A to open camera raw filter. Then we're gonna start with the lights, open the light tab, decrease exposure to minus 0.5 half decrease contrast to around minus 20 then decrease highlights to around minus 90 like this then we're gonna increase shadows and whites we start with shadows around plus 45 also with whites around plus 15 and for the last part here decrease blacks just like a touch, minus 5 is cool. Close lights and open color. Set temperature to around plus 90. Then plus 4, 14. Increase vibrance to around plus 15. Then decrease saturation to around minus 11. Close color tab. Then move to the next one. Open effects. For this part, we're just gonna decrease clarity to around minus 11 minus 12 is cool we don't touch the rest close effects and open curves we start with making some points as usual one two and three let's active and change the first point do a single click and move it to bottom guys take a look at the output it's already 255 decrease it to around 235 as you see right there do the same with this one do a single click active and move it to the top around 10 for the output it's fine let's close curve and open color mixer we start with hues move the reds to the right side like around plus 25 26 is cool then move the oranges to the left side just like a touch minus 4 minus 5 is cool we don't touch the rest now active saturation and decrease yellow saturation to around minus 90 94 95 is cool we don't touch the rest we also don't touch the luminance let's close color mixer and open color grading let's active shadows and change its hue to 180 and increase saturation to around 10 and as you see we got a nice bluish color already in our image let's take a look at the before and after before after before after let's move to the next one active midtones and change its hue to 53 and increase saturation also around 10 9 or 10 is cool now active highlights and change its hue to 70 and increase saturation to around 25 all right it's fine let's close color grading then open detail then set the sharpening to plus 30 don't touch the rest close details and we ignore optic and lens blur open calibration from the red primary part move hues to the right side to plus 20 we don't touch green primary and for the last part here move the heels to the left side i mean blues to around minus 23 and increase its saturation just like a touch plus 5 is cool and close calibration guys it's almost finished let's save our settings as a preset go to the three dots do a single click and choose create preset set a name for it for example i'm going to do some random touches like this then press ok now you can easily apply these colors each time with just a single click all you need to do just move to the right side choose preset icon right there user preset and as you see we got our preset right here do a single click and press ok all right i'm gonna press ok let's see what just happens let's take a look at the before and after before after before after before after that's it guys if you enjoyed this tutorial please do a favor share it with your friends thanks for watching stay creative and peace out